Over 3,000 treasures were placed in the tomb to help Tutankhamun in his afterlife, and the walls of the burial chamber were painted with scenes of his voyage to the afterworld. The chamber contained four gilded shrines, inside which was a red quartzite sarcophagus containing three nesting coffins. Tutankhamun's mummy rested in the innermost coffin. Tutankhamun was certainly not one of the greatest of Egyptian pharaohs. In fact, before the discovery of his tomb in 1922, little of his life was known. Today we know much more about this king, but surprisingly little of this knowledge comes the treasures of his tomb. Tutankhamun died around 1325 BC, after only nine years of rule. Apparently, he died suddenly quite as good a royal tomb, to our knowledge, has never been prepared for this pharaoh. Instead, the tomb of Tutankhamun is relatively small and follows a more frequently in non-royal tombs. Some scholars believe that the tomb that King I was eventually entered in was actually begun for Tutankhamun. In fact, the tomb of Tutankhamun is not as interesting as other tombs in the Valley of the Kings. Now we will show some treasures from the 3,000 treasures that were placed in the tomb to help Tutankhamun in his afterlife.